system. ABN Amro Bank Amsterdam wants to purchase rupee 15 million against dollars. So this is nothing but buy rupee sell dollar for funding their Nostro account with Canada Bank. Assuming the interbank rates, the interbank rates are given to you of dollar in rupee is 51.3625 and 51.37. What would be the rate the Canada Bank would quote to ABN Amro Bank? Further, if the deal is struck, what would be the equivalent dollar amount? Okay. So this basically, this is what is clear, right? From your purchase rupee, against dollar means buy rupee sell dollar two currencies are involved rupee and dollar when you buy rupee against dollar it means you are buying rupee and selling dollars right the interbank rates is also given to you so if you see of dollar is rupee this is nothing but rupee by dollar rates 51.3625 and 51.37 Okay, so this, how do you interpret this quote? This is a direct dollar quote in India. Why? Why? Because dollar is in standard currency. Okay, so this is a direct dollar quote. Great. And you have to sell dollar. You can take either, either buy rupee or sell dollar. Now we are taking sell dollar because we have a direct dollar code. So it would be easier. So sell. Okay, now in Forex, in Forex, what we do when we have two rates, bid and ask. We buy at high, higher rate. And we sell at a lower rate. Okay. This is from the customer's point of view. Now we are, but you will say that they are asking about the bank. What would be the rate the bank would quote? But if you see the bank would quote to another bank, okay, and they are giving an interbank rates. So you are one of the bank is the customer. Okay, so this is always from the, generally the question is always from the customer's point of view unless and until they say that you are the banker and the quote from the banker's point of view to the customer. Okay, in this case, both of them are the banks and the rate is given to you is interbank rate. So, we sell at a lower rate. Now, since we are selling dollar, we have selected sell dollar and this as this is a direct dollar quote given to us in terms of rupee by dollar, lower of the both is 51.3625, right? So, we have selected rupee by $51.3625. Now, what is the exposure amount? Buy or purchase rupee 15 million. Rupee 15 million, okay? 15 million, but in which currency? Rupee. So the exposure that is given to me is equal to rupee 15 million. Now, very important rupee, okay? And the quote that I have is a dollar quote. So since both the currencies are not same, okay, both the quote and the exposure amount are not denominated with the same currency, we have to divide this. Because only when you divide, if you see the rupee will cancel out and you get dollar. Right now I'm just explaining in brief, not going into extreme detail because this is a brief revision of the questions, right? So what we do, we divide or multiply this code we have to divide because common sense prevails when you divide this rupee will cancel out you will get an equivalent dollar amount right and that is what is asked in the question if you see what would be the equivalent dollar amount they are also asking the rate okay so what would be the rate we have selected this is the rate but the actual rate would be 1 upon 51.3625 Yes, because we have to divide. Now we have, which is which will be equal to zero point zero one nine four. Okay, this is the amount. Uh, this is sorry, the rate. 
are you able to understand right now we have the exposure amount so similarly we'll do this particular 15 million we we discuss this right how since the currency of the exposure is not the same as the dollar quote uh, sorry as, as the quote the currency is in rupee and the quote is a direct dollar quote so we have to divide this right so this would be the equivalent equivalent dollar amount is equal to rupee 15 million divided by rupee by dollar 51.3625 okay so how much calculate this it's very easy 15 million is 60 1 2 3 4 5 6 the whole thing divided by 51 51.3625 which gives me 292 Zero four one point eight. You can round it off, but currently I'm not doing the round off. I'm just keeping it this way. Currency is very important. This is dollar. This is the equivalent dollar amount. Okay, the rupee cancels out if you see it very clearly. Okay, so this is your another final answer.